Yo, my channel is all about love, peace, and harmony, but today we're gonna get into some <laughs> So be warned. <laughs> Damn, Deborah, did you at least pinch the <laughs> And Ashley, where were you to help your friend? footage and details have been released now remember originally they were saying that Deborah won the fight uh, it don't look like she won that fight at all however she did get help and it was from an actual friend of Ashley and not Giselle everyone thought this girl in the green was Giselle no this is Ashley's friend Sydney as you see here Sydney actually pulls Kiana's hair from the back and then that's when they all go crashing down and then Deborah was able to get on top of her but still Kiana whooped that ass. The girl in the pink everybody is confusing for Karen, her name is Jewel, she's Ashley's friend. She says this on her story, when you come to my friend's event and purposely post a negative altercation to get yourself more followers, you're already canceled. Godspeed to you. That's all I'm going to say. You won't get attacked because I'm sure you want the extra boost. Sorry. Then she says, I have no comment. How you made a comment, but you have no comment. And secondly, you weren't even in the fight. Shut up. So moving on to Deborah, you know I had to see if she had anything to say, and yes, she did. She is petty as ever. Let's go ahead and get into it. So yesterday, Deborah gave a shout out to her makeup artist, and then she posted this video showing her face, basically saying like, you know, she ain't got no scratches, no marks on her face. But then this is where the pettiness come into play. Yes, she posted the nail. So yes, this is allegedly Kiana's nail. Deborah says, you left your nail in my real ponytail that you unsuccessfully could not rip out. Let me know if you like it back. Now let me leak the whole video cause the floor work sure was something wasn't it special K. P.S. Did you enjoy your ambulance ride? Ouch. Punch me in my face first? No ma'am. The funny part is, it's always the person that loses the fight that got the most to say. And another thing too, we seen the floor work and it seemed like you were struggling to get up off of your feet. We didn't really see you throw any punches or anything like that, Deborah. I mean, if you got more footage, go ahead and leak it because at this point, it looked like you got Molly Rock. Now in the video that was leaked by TMZ, they did show video of like blood and glass on the ground. So maybe that's why Kiana ended up in the ambulance, but we don't know until we see the full footage of everything. Now what's crazy about this is that it's actually being said that the cameras were shut down. This happened after the cameras had shut down, but production was still there. You know, I'm still asking how we even got here. From what I can tell in the video leaked by TMZ, you see Deborah like reach over to Candace and like try to touch her shoulder. And then Kiana like pushes Deborah like to say, hey, back up, right? And then all of a sudden you see Deborah throw a punch and then that's when Kiana responded and then the girls was tussling. <laughs> now, if you remember, Monique had that fight with Candace and they said that she was violent and they didn't want to film with her anymore. Are they going to have that same energy for Deborah and Kiana? They should not be allowed to film anymore if they're so dangerous and they fight and all this other stuff. And also, did y'all see Candace pick up that big bottle of champagne? She looked like she was about to throw it. That's violent to me. Real Housewives of Potomac is starting to look like the Bad Girls Club. Is this show executive produced by Zeus Network and Natalie Nunn? But let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Again, I do want to say that it's not just the black shows that fight. The white housewives also fight as well too. All right, y'all. Deuces.